Topaz Denoise is designed to let you shoot anywhere in any light and still get crisp, clear, and noise-free images. Specializing in extremely noisy high ISO images, Denoise removes distracting image noise while preserving image detail, giving you the image you wanted without the noise you don't. When using Denoise, it is best to find an area of your image that has mid-tones, shadows, and highlights, allowing you to see the noise reduction and detail recovery in all tones within your image. If you are working with a darker image, choosing one of our auto brighten previews of normal or strong will allow for you to see and manipulate image noise easier. If you see banding noise in your image, which look like long, colorful lines of noise, you'll want to start with the debanding tab in the adjustment panel. Simply check the vertical or horizontal banding options, whichever you see in your image, and that should remove the majority of the banding noise. The default banding width setting of 20 is best for most images. If you do not have banding noise or after the banding noise reduction, navigate to the noise reduction tab to begin your noise reduction process. Denoise is extremely powerful, giving you several preview modes to isolate types of noise and control them with the sliders below. The overall strength slider works best when viewed in the Luma preview mode, showing your overall contrast noise. The overall strength slider is the main noise removal tool that reduces overall image noise, both contrast and color, and, and should be used with care, keeping in mind that overuse can soften the image and remove detail. The Luma preview mode is best for the adjust shadow and highlight sliders as well. To remove additional shadow noise that might be left over after the overall strength, simply move your adjust shadow slider to the right. Majority of the time you'll see extra noise in your shadows and less noise within the highlights of your image. So you may want to reduce the noise reduction that has happened within your highlights by taking your highlight slider to the left and increasing the detail. The adjust color red slider works best with the red preview mode, showing you your red channel noise. Should you see additional red noise, you can move your red slider to the right until you see a softening or slight pattern in your midtones. The adjust color blue slider works best within the blue preview mode and can also be adjusted until you see a softening or slight pattern within your midtones. The clean color slider works best within the color preview mode and can help to reduce any leftover large splotches or areas of hazy noise. The correct black level slider is best used within the RGB preview mode with the auto brighten preview turned off. This slider will remove any haze and restore the true richness of the blacks and shadows in your image. After the noise reduction process, move into your detail recovery tab. When working with high ISO imagery and removing a large amount of noise, some detail might have been lost within that process. The Detail Recovery tab offers the additional tools that you need to make sure that you have a clear and detailed image at the end of your denoise workflow. The Recover Detail slider brings original details back into the image. Move this to the right until you start to see some of the image detail brought back in. The Reduce Blur slider is an intelligent de-blurring function that's useful for correcting any blurry or soft edges after you've tried to recover the majority of the detail. Be sure to use this slider with care as overuse can actually result in edge halos and a noise amplification in smooth areas. The last slider, Add Grain, is going to add fine monochromatic grain to the image for a lightly textured and very natural look. This helps to remove any plastic or oversmoothing effects that are happening after the noise reduction process. When finished with your denoise workflow, you should have clean, clear, and noise-free results. For additional information about Topaz Denoise, visit topazlabs.com denoise.